Hi everybody, Gerdy van Voort here, Dare Great League Guiding Coach. And this is episode one of my series about how to safely hike mountains solo when you want to go into the mountains to immerse yourself in nature, to get away from all that is causing you stress, to get away from digital noise and hear yourself think again, reconnect with yourself again. And tip number one is choose a popular trail. Now you may be thinking, Gerd, you just told me this is all about going into the mountains solo and here you are telling me to choose a popular trail. I'll get back to that. But first, why a popular trail? Because a popular trail usually is um, well maintained and well marked. Well maintained means that the chances of you getting hurt are significantly reduced and uh, well marked means that um, the likelihood of you getting lost is uh, slim to none. And now those are when you go into the mountains for the first time or even when you go into the mountains solo and have mountain experience but are just a little bit nervous about going into the mountains solo can be uh, the best choice for you. So, hang on, there we go. Um, also, a popular trail, you may think, is overrun. And that's not necessarily the case. I've been on lots of popular, well-maintained tra trails around these mountains without running into a whole lot of people during the day that I was on this trail. And when you do run into people, because, you know, this probably will happen, you will find that... Um, that it's not necessarily a bad thing, because most people, like you, are there to hike their own hike. So, what usually happens is you greet each other and you move on. And even if you stop, both stop to have a conversation, it usually is just a short one. Where have you been? Anything special about the trail? Isn't it beautiful around here? Where am I going? Have a great day. And then you just move on. So you will have ample time by yourself, ample time to immerse yourself in nature, to let your mind quiet, go quiet and sometimes and find just spots to sit and enjoy the gorgeousness of the surroundings that you are in. So that's my first tip. Choose a popular trail. I'll be back for more later on. Uh, tomorrow and the days after but uh, if you are going into the mountains when you are thinking of going into the mountains solo or just want to go into the mountains for the first time or for that matter any other part of nature this is my first one go find a popular trail as always go there greatly and I'll talk to you soon bye